All right, what is going on, everyone? Let's move that out of the way. All right, what is going on, everyone? We're here at my mum's place. We're in Littleton. The weather has not cleared up, which kind of sucks, but this morning um, I'm doing what I've been meaning to do for ages, which is update my drone. So every like three or four months, DJI brings out a new update, and your drone won't work properly, and things will fuck out if you don't update it. And that's what I'm doing right now. And every time I do, I don't know exactly what's going on or how it works, but somehow it works. So basically it just beeps for about half an hour. Basically you download the upgrade onto your computer, you connect your drone to the computer, then you transfer the file from the computer onto the drone, because it's got a SD card in there, and then automatically it starts updating, apparently. So hopefully it's done pretty soon. Um, I'm going to make a coffee. Let's do that. So, I don't know if you guys remember seeing Littleton from my dad's place that got sold a few days ago, but that view was probably about there. Coffee, coffee. Oh, I've got some batteries, um, got some batteries charging, because you can't go out with no batteries, I mean, that's not going to work, is it? What the fuck is... Bl what? Read it with me, guys. I was like, I've never seen a blue Makona before. And I'll tell you why, because it's fucking decaffeinated. Are you serious, Mum? <laughs> well, isn't it lucky that I thought ahead and bought one of these? Oh, yeah. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Wherever you are in the world. I will stop I will stop drinking them soon, guys. I will. And look at that. First page of recommended videos. One on quitting caffeine. You can tell what I've been watching lately, eh? Alright, so I knew there was something wrong with the drone and my phone. I didn't know what the fuck was going on, but even when I was driving down in South Australia, when I took my drone out, I'd get it up in the air and about a minute or two into the flight, everything would just completely shut off. I'd lose, I'd lose everything. Alright, so we're still updating. I did a little bit of research and it, it seems that since June, people have been complaining about the same thing I have, about losing all contacts and, you know, your, your phone reboots randomly when the drone's in the sky over and over again. And apparently, from what I can read, it's something to do with the Samsung S7. Um, a thread was started back in June, people were complaining about it, and it's October now, and it's current. It's got page, page after page after page of people talking and um, people are still experiencing the same problems and Samsung has not come out with an, with a, an upgrade that fix it, fixes it. Because obviously Samsung and DJI would have to communicate and, uh, and fix this issue. So at the moment, Samsung S7, I can't use with my drone because it fucks out. And that's all I got. Because, oh fuck, because yeah, even, even when I was taking those pictures of, um, you know, South Australia and Cooperpedia and shit, it was doing the same thing. That's why I couldn't get any good pictures, because I'd get it up in the air for a minute, and then I'd lose everything. And, you know, and I wouldn't be able to see where the fuck it is, so I'd have to bring it back down, get it back up in the air, try again for another minute, and then it fucks out. So, I haven't been able to get any good footage, and it's really fucking me off. But, you know... A positive out of a negative, I always wanted an iPad screen rather than just a little phone screen. I mean, it'd be so much better to be able to see a massive fucking screen of what you can see rather than trying to squint down at a little phone. So I reckon I was probably going to get an iPad to use on my drone anyway, but it seems I've been forced into it, which I don't like at all. So with that said, guys, I don't know what I'm going to do. Fucking bullshit. Alright guys, so we're just still sitting here just doing some editing, rendering up a couple of videos, and I've got lunch. 
and that is three whole legs, uh, about 100 grams of ham, and some of this pickle relish sort of stuff that my mum does. It's fucking delicious. She used to do pre preservatives. She used to make preservatives as a business. So she'd do all sorts of pickling and chutneys and all sorts of stuff. So I'm going to get into this, guys. And it's about 3 o'clock. And I've got to go meet my mum at our family friend's place for dinner at 5. So I'm going to smash this down. I may hit a workout on the way. I may not. I doubt it though, because I'm just catching up on a bit of YouTube as well, so that's what we're doing, guys. And this is the view, out the bottom window. All right, guys, so we're off to dinner. It looks slightly better out there now. Pretty picturesque, really. See this road going up here goes all the way over the hill that we went under in the tunnel and in the earthquakes all of these rocks came down and completely destroyed the road. Now this road me and my mates used to drive every, pretty much every single day um, and now it's been closed for the last six years and it sucks because this drive is so amazing it goes along the side of this hill all the way up and then across and then over into Christchurch and the views you get along this road is are just unbelievable. It's all of this stuff, all the way along, and unfortunately, it's just too unsafe. Um, and actually, I think this is gonna be closed off too, so I need to go around. But, um, yeah, that's what we miss out on now. Fucking sucks. And there's all these little roads around Littleton that have just been absolutely fucked from the earthquake. And I mean, what a, what a joke this is, like, oh my God. Just absolutely no access. Look at look at these tiny little roads. <laughs> Quite funny, aren't they? Up on the hills. Classic Littleton roads from back in frickin' early, well, late 1800s, early 1900s, all this stuff was built. I mean, look at this one. This one's an absolute joke. It's called Stevenson Steep, because it's so motherfucking steep.